Hey Caleb, I wanted to show you a couple of pieces from uh, JBB. Everything you see here, uh, he made. And I'll just, uh, th this is the one you were inquiring about. But so here's the, this is a mini. The one you're looking at is a mini, and here's a small. And then he's got a regular size. This one's not nearly as fancy, of course, but they're both arresters, and it's the same model. Uh, uh, not quite as dressed up. JBB also makes a, uh, Brad Blount also makes a, uh, what he calls a power tool. This one's Mokutai. He, make, he made that bead and somebody else made this bead. Uh, it's a uh, pry bar if you want to, but again, in this expensive uh, condition, there's his JBB signature. Uh, uh, in the expensive material, not many people are going to carry it. It'd be pretty cool on the end of a keychain, but uh, I don't know how many people are going to use it. And this is a uh, this is the one you asked about. So it's a mini arrester. Um, this material right here is called hafnium, uh, and I don't know how he gets the color. It looks like it's uh, uh, he dips the hafnium in uh, oil, real hot oil, and that's usually how those that kind of color comes out. I'm not positive, but I believe it is. Titanium bolsters with a uh, fine a bead blast finish. Uh, it flips great. It's a little bit small in hand, but it flips great. Uh, satin finished blade. Great swedge. Sorry, I was a little close because I don't want to bump into these guys. Hang on one second. Let me get those out of the way and I'll be able to work uh, there. You'll be able to see it. So, again, lockup's perfect. There's no blade play. That's the hafnium from the inside. There it is from the backside. It's got a floating uh, back strap, but you can see it's cool stuff. Blade's dead center. Clip's great. There's the uh, lockup again. Easy blade release. Nice detent. Mill 3D hafnium pocket clip. All right, thanks for watching.